Good morning. And actually, welcome to the second round, second round of Insomnia Talks, because I want to touch on something. Some things change. Um, I have often, often made sure that I was smoking indica at night to make sure I slept better. I've seen people, some of some of you are my friends, uh, doing posts in Instagram and stuff at 4, 4.20 <laughs> in the morning, showing themselves having tokes at night to get themselves back to bed. And I always thought, I don't know what I thought. I don't know why I never tied it all together. I had a really good friend that always, just before bed, when we were on the road, uh, and we were on the road a lot for CP Rail, we would share. And we'd meet outside at the hotel just before going to bed and have tokes. And I always slept so beautifully. Yet I, although I'm smoking indica at night, usually, I, I really looked at it yesterday, and I can't believe this slipped my mind. I don't take... I usually stop smoking or toking or vaping or whatever hmm, half an hour before bed. By the time I feel like I'm going to bed, I just get up and go to bed. And uh, when I wake up during the night, it just seems like a lot of work to have some tokes, you know? So I battle the, the Sandman. I battle the Sandman and it's just a fight. Really, almost every night is finally fall asleep about 11, maybe 12, and at 3.30, boom, the uh, the tummy and the bowels and all that start acting up, and I'm up. So, last night, I changed. Last night, just before bed, I took a couple of large toes, and I pretty well fell asleep right away, and when the first wave hit me at 1.30 in the morning, just a small one, I had a toke. And I skipped the 3.30, went right to 4.30, and I had another toke and went to 5.30. I actually, pretty well, for, for me anyway, I slept through the night. So, here's a really busy day today. I didn't think I'd get a porch pondering out, but I took a few minutes. I uh, between the work that we do volunteer-wise and otherwise with MMJ Total Health, uh, helping them through sales and through web issues and all that, between that and family, you know, my son, half day at school today, and we're dog sitting. I've got my daughter's two dogs here, which always causes issues, but you do that for family. So, a very busy day. This may be it between us today. I am I hope to get to the comments, but I'm going to be super busy. So we'll see. I'll get to the comments tomorrow if I don't get, them, get to them today, because you all are super important to me. So let me know. Um, I'm going to continue on with this insomnia bit, and I'm going to start talking at night, and I'm going to see if this finally makes the change that I needed to make. One day is not a, an epiphany. One day could be just sheer luck. So I'm hoping it's not luck. I'm hoping tonight I'll do the same thing. Tomorrow night I'll do the same thing, and we'll see if we can get a new pattern going in my life. Fibro is very pattern-oriented. It seems to follow... It's cyclical. It runs around the body, and sure as shit, one day it's going to leave my my bowels and move somewhere else. I mean, it, it hasn't been in my chest for ages, and yet I don't want it there. <laughs> I want it to leave and just leave and not come back. My friends, peace and cheers. Happy Friday. Find people without smiles today. Give them one of yours. Yours is beautiful. Peace.